<coughs> oh, what's up? Uh, uh, oh, I'm on? Oh, what's up, y'all? It's your real deal, George Boy out here, boy. And hit my music right about uh, now. Oh, yeah. What's up, y'all? I'm the real deal Georgia boy. Well, shoot, I'm 19 now, so I should say Georgia man. CBR. I'm out here to talk to y'all. I'm trying to bring some laughter into y'all lives on this Easter Sunday. Because we got a lot going on in the world. It's crazy, and with all this pain and struggle, we should have a little laughter here and there. And heck, even everywhere. Heck, North Korea have to laugh, and Russia have to laugh sometimes. You feel what I'm saying? I think I shouldn't say it. I should have kept them out. I might lose viewers. But I don't know. It doesn't matter. I'm just saying, I'm here to make y'all laugh. Try to make y'all laugh. If you don't laugh, I don't care. I'm just saying what I feel on my mind today. First of all, let me give. First of all, that's like everybody start off when they win the award. Uh, I want to give honor to God who the head of my life. I don't think my mom did for letting me be here. First name CBR, last name Nation. Looking up in the book because it might become famous. Because CBR is going to be a household name one day. And I'm for real. And also, I go by a lot of names. They call me Mr. No Days Off because I don't get lost in the sauce. Yeah, that's true. That's word life. Word life. I'm sorry, I just took John Cena old thing. I think he wouldn't mind. But yeah, yeah, I'm here to make you laugh. Right now, if you haven't laughed by now, my job is not done. Uh, let's talk about what's going on in the world today. Last time I checked, Barack Obama was president. Broke out there. Y'all thought I was going to say, oh, Barack Obama's president. I wish to be real with y'all. I wish he was. I wish he was. Because right now, Donald Trump is running the goddamn government like should not ran death row. It's crazy. But in this death row, we don't have no Tupac. <laughs> we ain't got no Snoop Dogg in this one. We just got Trump and his family. Oh, my God. But at first, I don't like Trump. Let me be real with you. I didn't want Hillary to win either. I didn't like Hillary either. Hillary, Hillary, whatever name is, I didn't like her either. I threw my hat in for goddamn Bernie Sanders, boy. I felt the burn, boy. I felt the burn that I had to put sunscreen on. That's how bad I felt the burn. But then it got down to Hillary and, and Trump. Then you see all them folks talking like, oh my gosh. Why well, had to be down them to them too? And I'm over here like, like y'all seen that meme with Will Smith? When he was like, I was doing it. I was like, y'all had Bernie, bro. Y'all could have felt the burn. Now we feeling the Clintons and we getting Trumped out. Come on now. Yep. Hillary. I don't, did Hillary even have a slogan? I know Trump was to make America great. To be honest with you, when was America ever great? I'm not throwing shots. I'm just asking questions. Because I don't remember America being great. I don't. I really don't. But that, besides the point, now that Trump's in office... I can't say I hope, I can't be like, oh, I hope he fail. Oh, I hope he loses. Can't say that. Because if he lose, I lose. Heck, all of America lose. So I just got to be wishing the best of luck. Because if he mess up, the whole country get messed up. And when the money gone, when the money is messed up, my money's messed up. Your money messed up. Your mama's and them mama money messed up. Your aunties, your uncles, your grandkids, your grandmas, your granddads, your great 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 grandma's money's messed up. 
it's tall up from the flow up. So right now I leave that mess. I'm like, oh, on that subject, I'm leaving saying that Donald Trump, so far you've been to Florida too many times. Too many goddamn times, man. And for you to do a be a quote unquote better president that you're trying to be, please. Please, for our sake, the animal's sake, the human race sake, God's sake, get off the Twitter. You got to write something down to talk about. Get, let, let me find you an example. Yeah, I know this is just a, I don't know what that is. Just hold on. Get your sheet of paper like this. Get a blank sheet of paper like this, Mr. Trump. If you're watching, get a sheet of paper. Take that goddamn pen down and say, hey, you know what? We got secret missiles going over here. And then take that sheet of paper, fold it up, and stick it in your drawer. Simple as that. Simple. Well, that didn't go in my drawer. But you get the part. You get the problem with them. You get what I'm laying down, don't you? Just put it in the drawer, man. Stop tweeting, please. Now, that's one situation I got done talking out of the way. <laughs> now, let me go into this Black Lives Matter. Black Lives Matter, let me talk about this real quick. And I already hear some folks finna log off. They finna untune from my video. Oh, he's talking about Black Lives Matter. Let me exit out. <laughs> no, I don't exit out. Don't exit out. Gonna be real with you. When I I can't I can speak. I don't know if I can speak for everybody. If they want me to, but right now I'm speaking for me. When I hear the word Black Lives Matter, when and especially when I say it, I'm not going around saying like, hey, Latino, amigo. Your life don't matter. I'm not saying over here. I'm not saying, hey, white guy, Caucasian guy, hey, your life don't matter. Your life does not matter. We don't care about your lives. I'm basically, I'm not saying it. I'm saying, heck yeah. I'm saying, like, listen, your life matter. His life matter. Her life matter. But the black race is getting eliminated real fast. We getting gunned down and shot at an alarming rate. And we should focus on that. We're not saying don't focus on y'all. We're just saying, hey, give us a shout out. Pay attention to us. Help in us. Help, no, not help in us. Help stop the violence against us. Like, wave your hand be like, hey, stop. And when I say stop the violence, you better not. If you see a black brother getting beat down or getting finna get shot or get hurt for no reason, you better not run up with no Pepsi. I'm gonna go ahead and tell you that. I'm going after you. I'm going after Pepsi. Y'all better not run up with no goddamn Pepsi. Y'all better run up with some help, but not Pepsi. Don't let the commercial fool y'all. Stay woke, all right? Stay woke, y'all. That's my time. Kept a long story short, CBR, if you like the video, like, leave a comment. I'm just seeing how this go for the first time. This is five. I'm going to keep doing them. If they not, if they not five, if I get bad likes, nobody like it. I'm going to still keep doing it because I just want to mess with y'all. <laughs> but if y'all do like it and y'all want me to speak some more empowering, encouraging stuff, I'm going to get serious on the next one. So leave me some likes, some comments. Let me know what it is. What's up? How far it was? What do I need to add to the cup? Oh. And like I said again, this is the real deal CBR. I'm Mr. No Days Off because I don't get lost in the soft ATL. Where I stay, I rep it 24-7. 85, 7, 24, 7, 44, 7, 7, 11, 77. Backed up on little Joe. I just picked up the cash flow. And next thing you know, we all yelling dominoes. Plus, nobody I know got hurt in South Central today. So, today was a happy Easter day. Alright, that's the end. Thank you, y'all. And y'all have a rest of the nice day or a nice of the rest day. However you say, have the best of the rest day you got or the day or the day or the next day. Whatever. Until then, happy trails to you until we meet again. And from now on, I'm going to go to sleep. So, holla at you, boy.